There's something 20 inches below the ground. What? Whoa. It's behind us, behind us. Hey right, guys, so me and Elton have a very big announcement to make. We are going on tour and you guys can come investigate with us. We're doing a podcast. We are. And we're bringing the podcast on tour. So you can come watch the podcast live, possibly be in the podcast, and then afterwards investigate with us. And the reason why you can investigate where we're doing our podcast is because every single stop on the tour yep. and every podcast is being done from a haunted location. Yep. This is one of them. <laughs> yeah. Everyone that comes is gonna meet us and take a picture with us. Every single person, it is guaranteed. Yep. And I might be bringing all of the Dybbuk boxes <laughs> on tour. <laughs> I'm sure I might, you guys wanna meet the Dybbuk Which stuff. includes the one I have in the Conjuring House. Perfect. And it includes the Dybbuk doll creation that was made of the Queen Mary. Perfect. So all of that's coming with us as well. So we're also bringing a museum along with our tour. So we're very excited to be doing this. It's overnightparanormal.com. All the tour dates are there. All the tickets are there. Everything that you need is there. We're going on tour. 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 All right. Indiana State Sanatorium. Although over 100 years old, this location is fairly new to paranormal investigations, as it was only made available in 2020 making it one of our favorite places to ever visit and search for the spirits that still reside here. With over a dozen massive buildings stretching across this massive plot of land, well beyond 100,000 square feet of history, rooms are still full of paperwork, medical equipment, clothing, paintings, surgical tools, furniture, and an infinite amount more to discover. This Rockville, Indiana location has an unknown amount of paranormal encounters awaiting us. Some of the major sections include the commercial building, superintendent's mansion, the doctor's bungalows, water treatment facility, the tunnel system, administration building, power plants, nursing homes, Adams Hall, cafeteria, the hospitals, operation rooms, and yet far more. A total of 20 buildings on site, seven houses, three different hospitals, and a 14,000 square foot barn all of which originally sat on a 500-acre plot of land meant to act as a self-sustaining town, quarantined away from the rest of the world. The facility was created to be a place of hope and treatment that could cure tuberculosis. However, death, murder, and suicide quickly overshadowed any slight notion of positivity or hope. Mistreatment became extremely prevalent throughout the entire facility, which has led to an intensive amount of paranormal activity spanning from disembodied voices to poltergeist activity. Shadow figures have been clearly captured, and even the more provocative entities have shown themselves in photographs. It seems as though the spirits here are not hiding from visitors, yet just waiting and wanting to be found. Whether with the intention to tell their story or something far more malicious is for us to find out. From the years 1909 to 1968, this location was known as the Indiana Tuberculosis Hospital, and as of 1978, it became a state-run facility until 2012, when it finally closed, leaving it entirely untouched for eight years, everything left to slowly decay, hidden away within the trees. 1907 marked the official beginning of the Indiana Sanatorium Project with an approved funding of $250,000 to construct it. With a farm and workers on site, the compound became entirely self-sufficient and isolated from all the areas surrounding it. Over time, more buildings were added, with a school being built in 1918, the superintendent's residence in 1922, and doctor's homes shortly after. With quarantine a mandatory measure needed to prevent the spread of disease, no one was allowed to leave. The amount of patients exponentially increased, and at one point had a waiting list of 400 to be accepted into the facility. This was due to its incredibly high rate of recovery by the introduction of antibiotics in the early 1950s. 
and in reaction, more buildings were constructed. A chapel and five-story psychiatric building known as Adams Hall. By 1968, the sanatorium was shut down due to the discovery of the cure for tuberculosis. Two years later, it was repurposed as an assisted living facility as well as a mental health institution. This mix of patients caused a magnitude of problems and the public opinion drastically spiraled downward as more stories of horror were uncovered, ranging from accidents, mistreatments, and even cruelty towards patients. Frequent reports of the apparition of a woman near the office areas and voices of all ages and genders are heard throughout every inch of each building. The stories of malpractice within the hospital were never fully investigated until 2006, when a patient went missing only to be found dead in the nearby woods. Then in 2009, murder-suicide occurred between two maintenance workers with no clear motive as to why. By 2011, the sanatorium lost its license after an investigation showed that no prior issues were ever addressed or even attempted to be improved upon. The true extent of the paranormal activity here is nearly unknown. However, the stories and personal items that still remain here make it a hot spot full of a century's worth of spirits and stories alike to be discovered. <laughs> and this is the same place that you won't stay alone in. Yeah. You wouldn't stand right here for like two hundred dollars no. for ten minutes. No. I wouldn't stand here for a million dollars for five minutes. If they start <laughs> barking. Yeah. If they start oh. like. If they start barking or growling, there's something wrong. Because there's nobody else in here. What? Oh, that's so fucking cool. Wait, what? what? I've never seen it. That's so cool. That's insane. That's, you can see the hair and everything. That's so mm -hmm. cool. I'm just going to hang it go down my back. Right now? Right now. <laughs> oh. For what? I see her sweatshirt moving on its own. Shut up. It's pressing, it was pressing right into her back. I have never seen anything like that. Oh, oh my god, what is that? Something just scurrying on the yeah, ground. Yeah, it's coming towards us. I was like, it's on ball, it's on all fours. Oh, okay, now that my heart is on the floor. Oh, so funny. Okay, hide and clap. We're doing it. We did the first time ever at the Conjuring House. Last time we ever did it was Waverly Hills. Bring it back. Possibly you're doing it around. All right? The rules are very simple. Oh, the dog. Hilarious. Who set the pin up, though? That was me. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Really simple, we're putting five minutes on the clock. When you get to ask for three claps, three times of clapping and that's it. Yeah? Okay. Okay. Can I hold on? 30 seconds and go. Five, four, three, two, one. Go ahead. Alright, don't let me die. This is harder than I thought it would be. Okay. Uh, clap. Technically, one more. Okay. There's someone over here somewhere. That has to be Elton. Probably threw the bowling pin at me. Doggy, show me where they are. Oh, 
one minute left. Uh. Oh no, I don't have any more claps. Where am I supposed to? <laughs> okay. Oh, 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 oh my god. Oh, oh, oh. Was, that, was that random? I heard her breathe. Oh. <laughs> Why'd you breathe? I'm sorry. Come on. 10 seconds. Oh, I can't do this. Five, four, three. Oh, yes. You got him? <laughs> three seconds left? Let's go. Woo! Let's go. Oh, that was pretty good. That was aggressive. That was actually five minutes, good. huh? I kind of forgot. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Would you rather be solo with an EVP That's recorder? Great. Or would you rather do hide and clap? For how long? Sorry. Both would probably be five minutes. I'll go solo. Whoa. Okay. Oh. Let's do it. Wow. I had a feeling you were going to pick that. <laughs> you were prepared. <laughs> Ask anything? Mm -hmm. Anything you want? Yeah, anything you want. I'll leave this here with you. We'll leave a camera guy very far away. Okay. And that's it. But then basically you can stay alone while we go get the gear. So I will leave that with you. Thanks, I appreciate it. And one of you yeah. can stay and the other one come with us. Who would you prefer? Doesn't matter. It's only gonna be a couple minutes. Rock, paper, scissors, shoot. <laughs> <laughs> Rock, paper, scissors, shoot. What is your choice then? Is uh, he staying? I'll stay. Hey! <laughs> I just like that game. Good luck! Have fun! We're in the morgue. Um, this is your first investigation, right? Yes. You've never been a part of any paranormal investigation before? Nope. But you're actually looking for ghosts? Yep. Okay. Well, Do you want to pick out the first tool that we, we should use? tell what the tools are? Okay. It's a REM pod. It detects uh, any change in temperature as well as uh, physical touch. SLS. SLS. This, this is, is pretty much like a Xbox Connect. You know? Have you the seen that normal? Yep. Yeah. Yep. Exactly. Yeah, so it shows the stick figure. Yeah, yeah. Exactly. Yeah. EMFs, K2s. We got Flashlights. the flashlight for the flashlight game. This is all set up. Would you like to? Do you want a manic? Either one. Sure. Okay. There's that. So just repeat after us. Oh, cat ball. All right. Hello, my name's Corey. Hello, my name is Matt. Hello, my name is Ethan. If there's anyone down here that would like to talk to us tonight, tonight's our only night here. We don't mean any harm at all. We set up a bunch of tools all around the room. We have little balls. Pause. <laughs> there you yeah, go. Yeah, just like that. Exactly. See, you already know how it works. You already know how it works. We have multiple stuff set up around everywhere. So you already made the cap all go off two times, I think. So I think that means that you do want to talk to us. But just to confirm, can you make one of our tools go off one more time? Yeah, it's like grabbing me. It's grabbing me? It's like reaching out and elongating towards you. Oh, cat ball, cat ball. Damn. And it just went away. It immediately just turned off. It immediately just went away. If you're in the doorway, can you try to put a little bit more energy into that device? It'll beep even louder and it'll change oh, colors. So that what? You? There's something attached standing in front of the box. Cat ball behind you. Keep it there, though. Keep it on that one. Can you wave to us? If you're standing in front of us, can you give us a wave? He shaking his head like no. Yeah. Cat ball again. We don't. We're not here. We don't mean you any disrespect whatsoever. We're just here to communicate. Maybe, maybe you can tell us a little bit about what happened here. There's movement to my left. There's anyone here that wants to talk to me? You're more than welcome to come up to me and talk into this blinking red light in my hand. Can you see anything around me? I feel like there's so many people standing next to me. How was it? Somebody walked up next to me. He was like, <laughs> held their hand around mine. Like, held her hand. Ooh. Compared to 
<laughs> yeah. Just so you know, that was my biggest fear. Really? Just being alone <laughs> in the dark. And you faced it. That's great. I did. Congratulations. She did Thank great. You. Good job. Great. Thank you. And now you don't have the fear. I mean, honestly, that should be a great fear for you to conquer. Yeah. Given your job here. <laughs> yeah. It, this, it's the reason why I have that fear, is because of being in the dark here. There's, I've seen some, I've seen some things that have scared the crap out of a lot of people. How do you feel now? I feel like I probably do pretty much anything. <laughs> Hell yeah. Thank you. That was awesome. Do you want to try first? I think we should go upstairs to the fifth floor. Okay. I'll go to the fifth floor. I already faced one too. I'm Mine just wondering if having two females up there might make it a little bit more. It might. You ready? Mm-hmm. Did you work here? Okay, can you can you stop touching it for us, please? Thank you. Thank you. Were I'm you a doctor? Me. How about this? I, or, to talk to it, can you stop touching it, please? Can you please stop touching it? Thank you. So we're, we're gonna ask you yes and no questions. Give us a beep for yes, leave it silent for no. Do you see, walk over here, do you see anything in the doorway? Oh yeah, look down the hallway. Anything? If there are two or more souls, spirits, entities with us, could you please make both of those go off again? Oh, there's two Ooh, of them. Two. Sorry. One's like on the wall and one's kind of... Ooh, that one's climbing up. Oh, no, there's both of them are on the... Yeah, both, yeah, they're more towards the middle. There you go. Wait, but it looks like one is upside down. Hey there, you guys. If you can see us, can you wave? That one on the left kind of looks like it's waving. But also look at the one on the top. Yeah, what's it doing? Okay. Are you stuck here? What the fuck was that? Full human spirits. If you're over oh. by the tub, we were told that... Go on, just left. That's where they would put all the bodies. Oh, there it is. Oh, it's close. Could you touch that cat ball on the tub, if that's true? I would like to know the year that you passed away. Make any of our devices go off when I get to the decade. Corey, he got one on the vent above you. Stay right there. Was it the 1960s? The 1970s? Was it the 1980s? Was it the 1990s? All right, was it the 2000s? Okay. If you don't want to talk to us, ooh, oh. we're gonna say goodbye to this room. So if you want to say goodbye, just make one of our tools go off. We're gonna start packing up and we're gonna leave. Touch. They're saying goodbye. Yeah. Well, hey, thank you. Thank you for the communication that you have with us. Thank you. I don't really know the S test method, so I'm not sure exactly what we're doing. Sensory deprivation. Person wears noise canceling headphones with a blindfold. It's connected to a spirit box or the S box. That scans through white noise. Uh, and the person who's under repeats what they hear. Okay. But they can't hear what's being asked. Let's go further down the hallway. That hallway's trapped. Good one. I think so. I like how it feels. Do you like having the feeling, the ability to communicate? For sure. For sure. Do you hear that? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Bro, it sounds like a walking. Bullseyes. Bullseyes. It's a staircase. 
It's like some of the strings are running, dude. They're running up and down the staircase. Yo, that's creepy Both as hell. Heads. Are those your friends? Down the Satanic. hallways. Satanic. Satanic? Mm -hmm. On the radio, you're hearing that from the radio. Who's running? It's coming from over there. It's coming from both ends. It's both ends, really. The thuds are on that side, and almost like the creak, like the slow, menacing footsteps are down this hallway. It's like straight up, like straight up, straight up. Sprinting. Who's on the stairs? you tell us if you know who's making those sounds? Should we be worried? Are we in danger? Are you putting us in danger? Do you not like Murder? us here? Especially in this portion of like mm -hmm. it. Is that a threat you just made? Murder. Can you tell us how? It's your preferred method. Please leave. We're not going to leave. If we don't leave, will you try to make us leave? Oh, hello? If there's anyone in here that would like to talk with us, we've set up a few devices around the floor and you can put your energy into those. And communicate with us. Hello? I think I can see you. Can you wave to us? Where'd you go? Disappeared. You don't have- It's because I said I could see you. Oh, maybe. You don't have to be scared. We're not gonna hurt you. Do you want to talk to us? Yo, he's back. Oh, there's two. There's two of them. Hey, guys. Yeah, they're gone. It's like as soon as we acknowledge them. It's okay, we're here only to be friends. That's it. My name is Ethan. My name is Matt. And my name is Corey. It's very hard for us to see you. Can you see us? Mm. What was that? You heard it? Yeah, like, yeah. Like a, it was like, it was a voice. Yeah. It was like a, hmm. Mm, yeah. Are you scared to talk to us? The people that work here, can't control you anymore. You're allowed to speak to us. Oh, hello. Nice to meet you. You can stand up. You don't have to lay down. Can you stand back up? I'm bot. Maybe that's a dog. The camera's out there, so whatever. Are you? Oh, wow. That's a very long arm or leg you have. Oh, there you Whoa. go. Oh, you're tall. Wow. We didn't realize you were so tall. How tall Can are you? Can you wave back? Hello? Are you climbing onto the ceiling? Can you? Oh. Oh, this, I forgot about this. What? There's been so many times investigating where we would look around and see nothing. But then as soon as we look up onto the ceiling. There's a bunch of them up there. Is that behind me? What? Whoa, my, nothing, whoa. What? My, whoa. What? I, I, okay. I thought, okay. I thought you were laying your head on you. Dude, This, shut this up. is what I saw, like, 
on your shoulder. I saw this. Shut up. And I thought it was you, dude. Okay. It's okay. Let's hope it was your eyes playing. Did I just, did I just see you? What I was gonna say was, there's been many times that we'll look at the ceiling, and that's when we'll find all of them, because they're crawling around. Like, well, yeah, I guess if you're not limited to ground, why would you walk? Exactly. Dude, I saw a face on your shoulder, literally like, like its mouth was wide open. That's, that's scary. Mm. Why well, a paint chip on wall? But like, down there, uh -huh. out of nowhere? Uh -huh. You just accidentally brush into the wall. You're trying to sneak up on us. You don't need to sneak up on me, I'm right here. Not moving. Hands in my pocket. He's completely defenseless. Who's staying in 510? Where is Ed? Hey. Oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know, you tell me, where is he? Oh, bro. <laughs> that oh my was so God. weird. Every single hair on my body just stood up God. at the same time, I swear to God. Is that whistling? You running around trying to figure out a way out of here? Spirit box. Cat ball, cat ball, cat ball. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Oh, you gotta be kidding me. Oh my god. That was god. the most hilarious reveal ever. <laughs> was it him? Yeah, he was right there fucking Buddy. <laughs> Hello. It's gone again. As soon as we acknowledge them, they disappear. It's almost like they're like afraid of getting caught. Are you not allowed to talk to us? Is someone not letting you talk to us? Will they hurt you? If you do? Maybe they make a different type of equipment. I'm gonna open it up. I'm gonna get behind this. All right, I'm gonna put this up. We can take a little break from this. Okay, let's do it. You take the... Bro, oh, no way. Dude. Something is running. Dude, right. I don't want to stand over here. Where's Ed was wild. Yeah, where yeah, Ed you said where's Ed. Yeah, I I mean it came out the way it came out, it sounded like someone talking, like not from the radio. Mm -hmm. It wasn't that clear, but I still heard it, so I was like, ah, where's Ed? And it makes sense because Ed is down in four four ten. Four ten like, would be directly underneath us. Is there anyone here? Square. Old square read. Can you tell us your name? Oh my god. What's he, what's he doing to us? What is it, buddy? What's insane is we were hearing so many more noises before we investigated. Do you think it's an energy thing? Early. Earlier. You just said that. Can you tell us oh what room? God, don't do that. Reached and dominate. What does that mean? Reach and dominate. Ground. Ground. Warrior Cupcake Man. Warrior Cupcake Man. Inches. Oh, that's done. Inches and dig. 
20. 20 inches? Inches dig 20. Is there something 20 inches below the ground? Probably. What? Whoa. That's such a specific answer. Do you know what's 20 inches in the ground? We're aware. I hear footsteps out there. I put in something. You know. Who knows? Anything you want to say, get off your chest. Talk about, thinking about. Elton. Okay. You thinking about me? Your luck? Why are they back? He's making fun of you. From the dogs, they're still following us. Your luck. Well, why are the dogs still here? It's been like a half hour. And they came back? Unless they- They were real quiet earlier. Did they yes. not whimper until he said my name? Yes. Was that, did yes. they start whimpering right when Aaron said my name? Mm-hmm. Are the dogs afraid for us? Of you? Any kind of answer here? I soul. Please leave. Why'd you get so quiet? Dead. Dead. Me. Say me? Me. Hold it. Hold what? Maybe it's been a while Please since- Please never take me. Please never take me? Inside you. Where should we go dig? Gravity. Rope. Rope. Rope and gravity. That's yeah. like a suicide. Yeah. Did you, did you commit suicide and then they buried you in the ground? Are you saying that you or someone else is in the ground? Oh, I just saw something. Nuh-uh. Something about one? Yeah. Exit. Muddy. Muddy. Because it's raining outside? It does look like it's like focusing on something back there, see? Yeah. New moon. Are you saying that you were buried near the exit? There's no dog over there. No. Dude, why is it getting so rude? We know everyone that worked here or was a patient here or visited here has a story. We just don't want to know what yours is. What buddy back there? Is the dog able to see you? Can you tell me more? Is it inside that hole? Yeah, it's inside the hole below it. That'd be bright. It looked like somebody was standing. Uh, the same thing. Aaron Doe. Aaron Doe. Clear as day. Clear as day. What the fuck? Bro, what the fuck? Is everything what's happening? We just came in because we were running up and we were literally saying like you can't give us a reason to stay here and communicate with you we're gonna leave. <laughs> and I literally turned the corner. Bro literally said Aaron go. Believe me.
I was literally saying that we, I didn't think we had anything lining up at all, and then you say, we should stay. Fuck you. Bro, what the fuck? You heard fuck you on I a spirit heard box? I just heard fuck you on a spirit box, like something, well, at least it sounded like fuck you, but. Do you not like it that we're all in here? Follow. Follow. Well, follow him. Greetings. Coming. Who's They're coming? coming or something like that. Who's on the innocent? That's it. Let's go down there. Innocent. Okay. Did you say innocent? Yeah, it said innocent. That's one of the last things. That's weird. You said murder earlier. Was there something evil? In the ground? Something bad. Could be a weapon. Yeah, it literally could be anything. Okay, okay. Was it a weapon? Oh, wow. My eyes are playing tricks on me. Um, I thought there was something huge hanging right here. Oh, man. I mean, you saw something tall on the SLS. Dude, that's weird because it was as, on the SLS, it was as tall as this Massive. pillar. And I literally just saw something, but it was like this. It was like to the ground. I thought it was something hanging. Did something happen right here? Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this daily bread, give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trust and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. Lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. For thine is the kingdom, the power, and the glory, forever and ever. Amen. Peace. As I finish the prayer. <laughs> Would you like to say goodbye to us by touching one of our devices? Okay, we're gonna leave you now, goodbye. Goodbye. What activity would you expect to see the most down here? Here's some giggling. It's kind of common in here. Don't get it. Maybe that's perfectly good TV behind. You think they got Family Guy on that thing? No. Oh. Seriously. Oh. <laughs> yeah. Anyone down here want to play a game? Get. Oh, that's my alarm to meet up with them. Uh, the K2's going off. Show us where in the room you are, we can throw you the ball. What do you got? What do you got, Jonah, huh? Come on, come on, show what you got. Go ahead. Hit yeah. me. Yep, yep. I see where it's coming. I got it. Oh, that's really Damn, that's impossible. You impressed? Do you play soccer on a home school team, too? You can make fun there of Jonah if you want. That was a regular school team. <laughs> that was so good, dude. It's good impossible. Job. Okay, it's pitch black. We got a radio silence. Oh! Oh! oh. <laughs> okay. All right. See if these some footwork. Wait, did you hear that? Yeah. Yeah. It, that was on the other side of the room down that one. Yeah, that's what I thought. Someone coming in here to play? Right over there. Mm -hmm. Right over that way. You don't have to be afraid of us. We're not gonna hurt you. All right, let's go meet up with the other guys right. and see. Maybe they're in the same boat as us, or maybe they've had the world of luck. Right. Look at that. Put the ball back into K2. Look at that. Ball back into K2. Really? Look at that. Put the ball back. Really? I'm literally putting the ball back. <laughs> Look at that. Put the ball back.
And it stopped. Bro, I got a split in my headache right now. Do you have a headache? Yeah. Here, okay, okay, okay. I'll come with you. I'm just scared. Pussies. I don't need somebody. Oh, God. Yeah. Where are you going? <laughs> <laughs> Is there a cap on the floor? Yo, you're behind us, behind us, behind us. Cap on going crazy. Who oh, said that there? Who said that? Yo, who said that there? I didn't. I are you serious? Is that not one of ours? Dude, there's another cap on Wait, there? Who said that there, though? We were, we we were here. We have two. We were here earlier, and that was never there. And it just went off on its own? Yeah. Died. What did I say? <laughs> You're like, this is karma. I figured some my oh, flashlight. Yeah. Here's some. And wherever that goes, you're gonna go get it. Nope. It's still going off. Yeah. Hey, what's up? Two up there, and they went real quiet. And then it said he said Elton's name through an Estes, and they both started whining again. Yeah, the dogs were like radio silent, and then as soon as he said my name through the fear box, we all of a sudden the dogs were like back. Our dog knew where we were when we were in the morgue and stayed upstairs and was whining a yeah. lot. Yeah. He just sat on the stairs whining. Even when we came upstairs to that level, he stayed on the stairs and like looked through the thing like he was scared it looked like. In, in theory, dogs can see all the different things we can. Mm. They can feel things that we can't. You know? They know about things we don't. Yeah. They choose to be here over being home. Yeah. Like, they belong to someone here, but they choose to be here, and they choose to, like, kind of guard us. I know. We have to go down this hall. Why? There's a bunch yeah, of caps. Oh. <laughs> there we go. <laughs> I was yelling at oh. oh my god. What? Didn't know she was next to me. <laughs> <laughs> Welcome oh, to the I Twilight Zone. You know where I am? Here. You can... I forgot the intro about Twilight Zone, but here you can do Here you can, the where the strange happens and the weird occurs. <laughs> that was all he's getting. <laughs> if there's anyone in here, uh, we might have a little comedy show. Mm. We're going to tell some jokes, you know, maybe get some laughs. If you guys want to come in here and join us, you can. Did you see that? Did you see that? You see that? You saw that? Oh, no, we don't it's the, 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 the lasers. The lasers. Oh, Did something break the laser grid? Yes. Yeah, shut yeah. up. That'd be first for us. Did you catch on camera? Does it show up on either camera? Uh, it shows up on mine. You see the little flashes? Yeah. I know we closed the doors, but you can walk through those. You can open a door. Well, that's all a myth, and we can't. It's like, one time. Like, well, no. Oh, whoa! Whoa, shit. Whoa, whoa. Dude, whoa. that, was that, like, perfectly stable? Yeah, it was fine. It was there the entire time. And now, that and now that's going on. Bro, they knocked that off the table. I don't like your girl's point. Like yeah, when did what happen? What was last thing said? Over here. Guys, let's put stuff back here. Yo, Mr. Roy, something over here. Wow. Well, that's strange. That was amazing. Okay, so you are in here. You want to join us for the show? Hey, look, they broke it. No, really? No. No. Oh, my goodness. Everybody take a seat. Get ready for the show. What kind of show do we want from Grumpy or one? Comedy. Cuffs. <laughs> Comedy slash crumb. <laughs> <laughs> and now, for our first performer coming to the stage at a whopping 5 foot 8, he's barely a man, and before you ask, the carpet does match the drapes, 
Give it up for Crumpy the Clown! Damn! Yeah. Damn! Yeah. Get him, Crumpy! Get What's up, boys and girls? What's your name, huh? My name's Ethan. Oh, wow, what do you do for a living, Ethan? I work at Walmart. You work at Walmart? Yeah. Oh, no. <laughs> Are you dead inside? Very much so, yeah. Oh, my God. You can't ask that shit, Grumpy! Yeah. <laughs> hey, Grumpy. fuck you, Grumpy! You're crossing a line. Yeah, Grumpy! <laughs> Turn around, Grumpy. Show us the dumpy. I knew it! Grumpy! Grumpy. 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 Yeah! Ladies and gentlemen, please give a big warm welcome to our resident clown, Carnivore Corey. Solid entrance. Solid entrance. Ah. He's an entertainer. Yeah. Good. That was an entertainer. Wow. That guy eats meat. What's up, everybody? <laughs> Are there any spirits in here? <laughs> hey, there. Th so what's up, ev everyone? Welcome, Mr. Matt the Cat Psycho. <laughs> <laughs> What is Mario's favorite ghost hunting tool? What, what is it? The Luigi board. Oh. oh. I, have a, I have an impression request from you. Could you um, could you please do me a favor and give me Machine Gun Kelly Clarkson? Hello, Kelly Clarkson. Since you've been gone, I've been fucking Megan Fox. Boom, that's pretty much all I got. <laughs> I know you want it. <laughs> Alright everyone, please give a big warm welcome to Shaquille O'Neal Patrick Harris. Woo! Yo! Fox out, fox out! Yoohoo! Big summer blowouts! <laughs> This device that we have here, it's meant to give you a way to communicate with us verbally. We believe that you're able to pinpoint certain words through the radio frequencies that you can transmit to us. This might sound hectic, and a lot of chaos, but we are just here utilizing this to listen to you. Say? And again, I can't see. Uh, I can't see. I heard I can't see. Are you trying to talk to us? I heard, what do you want? We just want to talk to you. We want to know your name. I'm hoping that you want someone to talk to. Are we annoying you? Do you want us to leave? Ask me our name. Ask me our name. Ask me our name. What is your name? Oz. Oz? 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 You're Oz, right? Oz. 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 Yeah. Is your name Oz? Help us. Get out. Get out. Help us to get out. Get out. Help us to get out. Get out. Whoa. Are you stuck here? Wait. Yeah. Oh. Yeah. 
Look how close it is. Capital. Capital. Yeah, I know you did not touch that chair. No. Possess me. It just said possess me. Is it the box? Help me get out. After I just relocked it all back up. And it said possess me. Closer. Are you inside the box? You are inside the box. And you say open. Open up the something. you guys had fun thank you guys for for joining i know you drove out here and, and all that fun stuff thank you for having us yeah now you get oh, to sleep here but in a nice bed down there and as opposed to in there yeah <laughs> so technically the investigation is not over it's yeah you know you, you guys could are wake staying, up you guys are staying in a previous children's ward so yeah yeah, yeah. yeah. the whole place is haunted yeah. You know, originally she brought a backpack with a blanket and pillow to actually sleep in the building you are ready to do that Wow. Oh my god. And then I have something that I need to do. Yeah, that's all you, buddy. Yeah, have so, fun with that. Fun. I'm making that happen. How far away are you going to go? Oh. Uh -huh. Pretty far? At least 100 yards. This far. No. Mm, this far. No. I don't know. This far. You get any closer, I'm going to kiss you. <laughs> Come on. Whoa. This far. Come on, bring it. <laughs> How far? No, he's actually. Oh. No, wait, I know Elton. I've seen other videos. You'll actually kiss me. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Elton kissed me at Sarah Bordo. Did I? Yep, in Enough. the snow. Not in camera, though. Yeah, oh, on no, camera. The, no, oh, no, it was, it was on camera. It wasn't meant to happen, but. Oh, yeah, but it happened. Yeah. Oh, I thought you were talking about the other time. <laughs> oh, no, 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 no. no. All right. Yeah. It's raining. Perfect yeah. time for this. Yeah. What is it right now, anyway? 5 30? Almost 5. 5 in the morning? Perfect. 5 in the morning. Five. I'm gonna pitch you. No, I'm gonna pitch you. I'm gonna suggest this. What? Before I open the box, and then open the boxes in the box, I will say I'm not 100% confident that I know what I'm doing, especially with us traveling via the motorhome. And if I mess it up, and I'm supposed to create the ring of salt around me, but it's raining, yeah, that would dissolve it. Yeah. And I have a feeling that might cause something to go wrong. Yeah. So don't do it. Right. I'm going to. Why? Well, no, maybe not tonight. It. Because tomorrow we're seeing a psychic medium. Very well known psychic medium, and I'm actually kind of curious to know mm. what they would think. Like if the I right just had way. this item that's covered, yeah. what she would think, what she would get from that. And also, then maybe it won't be raining. And the one main thing I was told I have to do can't get ruined. Yeah. So I'm not trying to like draw this out. I'm just actually, I don't know. I agree, you should not do it. Definitely and don't do it. You should wait until you speak to the medium. Yeah, if the medium says you should not do it, are you still gonna do it? Yes. Oh my god. But I will wait until the weather says I can. <laughs> when weather permits. I hope it rains. When, 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 when weather right permits, here. yeah, sorry for, sorry for the rain delay. Uh, I will open the Divic Box the next episode. Okay. I like that idea though. Okay. I really do. Divic Box on three? Nope. One, <laughs> two, three. three. God, Divic God. Box. God is, is my, God is my savior. savior. I thought you meant I didn't read the Mr. Boots trivia question, <laughs> and I ran out of the tunnel. That was. Oh, and you didn't go by yourself tonight. Yes, I did. Where? I ran. I where? 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 Whenever, where? whenever where? we were all walking, where? I was in the very back. How do you keep snaking your way out? You lost it, bingo. Listen, you ever heard of God? <laughs> hey, hey, listen. Hey, that's my man. This is proof. This is proof that God real. I ain't give a shit. I ain't give a fuck. No, wait a minute. You ever heard of rain? Oh! Why weren't you? Because you said I'll do it for you, Corey. Uh, no, I said I'd do it with you. 
That's not a lot. Why are you a pentagram on your pants? A pantagram. Oh, just because I don't know we're ghost hunting it's an and it's like, it's anarchy. I don't know, it's like a fashion statement. Why are you diverting the conversation away from the fact that you didn't go alone and you cheated last night? Do not tell my girlfriend. Oh my God. <laughs> <laughs> and, and see, that's what it is. <laughs>